Hello, authentic. Hello, hello, authentic. Test the microphone. Test the microphone. It's so down here. Hence the I to the D to the E to the A. It's been like four months now that I did a sit down video. When I was setting up my camera and everything, I was like, can I even do this anymore? It feels so strange saying, hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. <laughs> it's a girl here with a J. And have I even wished you guys happy new year? Happy New Year! <laughs> Happy New Year 2024! This year, we know they're going for any body. I can't believe that I'm saying this right now. I've been procrastinating this video. Actually, for people that have been following my channel quite a lot, you'll know that the last set of videos I did, especially vlogs, was when I went to America. I was in America for quite a while. And when I came back to UK, it was just a roller coaster. It's been from one thing to the other. I decided to take a little break off social media. I was not on Instagram, you know, for quite a while. I was not really posting much. And before I realized it, the little break turned to a bigger break. I had a car accident in between. Yeah. And then so many other things crawled into my life. And yeah, it's just what it is, my dear. And then I'm so grateful. Uh, to people that checked up on me. I was quite healed at a point. I, I was very down and I'm so grateful for the love of family, for the love of friends. This video that you're seeing today is because of some people that God has put in my life. Some subscribers, some friends that have been checking up on me online. Where is that video? I can't count how many messages I got. I don't even know I was this loved. <laughs> it's going to be good in this time. I said, you need to see guys. You need to see, I missed this scene. I'm, I can't remember the last time I raised my voice like this. I'm so grateful to everyone that checked up on me. Midaja, where is the video? We missed you on YouTube. Like, I told them, don't worry, my dear. Hold up, hold up, hold up. I'm coming back to the YouTube straight to give you the video back to back. This year is going to be hot. What is our motive? What is our motto this year? No grief for anybody. This year, I am not green. On this YouTube. I have so many things planned out, guys. You don't want to know. Even me, I'm so super excited about all the good things, all the goodies, all everything, everything that I'm bringing to your screen this year. Like, trust me, that break was not for jokes. You will see lots of new faces on this channel this year. So many other things that I have in play or in store for you guys. But then, if you're new on this channel, I need you to do something for me. Please click on the subscribe button. This is a new year. If you know you come to this channel to watch, you love me, DJ, you love my content, why not subscribe? It will not cost you anything. Just click that subscribe button. And don't forget that little bell like symbol by the side of your screen. And what does it do? YouTube will notify you whenever I post a new video. That's it. When I post, you get alerted. Okay, now let's get right into this video. Welcome back guys. Uh, like I said, this video, I'm just giving a life update to what's been happening with me. So many things have happened and I felt like, okay, I just need to sit down and talk to you guys. For people that miss me, I miss you too and I love you so much. Thank you for always checking up on me. Mideje, Mideje, where are you? We missed you here. I love you so much. I love all my friends that checked up on me. It was just so much. Oh, trust me, it's been... Uh, all love from here and i don't take it for granted it's a thing of being off social media off instagram off youtube and you see how people checking up on you like oh where have you been we miss you so much you don't get that privilege all the time and i'm so grateful trust me when i say that when i came back from america i did loads of vlogs like vlogs even till now i still have about two to three vlogs to put out there and guys i don't even know what to do at this point because now i'm back from america and other contents are rolling in do you think i need to still put out this america vlogs or i should just shut it there i filmed i filmed and i filmed at a point i was being discouraged about my youtube channel because i felt like some of those vlogs didn't do well and i think it's okay that's where i'm gonna come in to talk to other people other your uh you know growing creators like me it's quite hard and this year i think one of the mistakes i made last year is that i didn't maximize my other social media platforms to grow my youtube if you go to my instagram i don't really post much of my youtube there apart from stories to say oh there's a new video i need to keep doing more reels keep doing 
you know, putting myself out there for people that are not even following me to uh, see my content. So I think I boxed myself in a way last year. Like I didn't want to do much. Trust me when I say that I'm a very creative person. I'm that person that if I go to a village alone, looking at everything, I can put one or two together and get creative and post on social media and get people engaged in that a particular um content last year i felt like i was just boxing myself oh, i don't want to do much i don't want to be seen as doing much my dear anything you're doing this year and that's why i'll talk about some lessons that i learned last year some lessons i will put into this year you know to make me a better person whatever you're doing don't be ashamed to promote yourself if you don't do it nobody will do it for you trust me when i say that like you have to push yourself of course, you have some good people in your corner that are going to be like vouching for you, rooting for you. This video you are seeing now is not a coincidence. Some people who pushed me to say, Medeje, your break is enough. <laughs> Even though it's not a long time, you need to do a video this year. Do something, you know, you can't just, the break is enough. It's enough. Especially my mother. She was, <laughs> she's my biggest fan. She's always like, what is happening? Your fans. You always call my subscribers my fans. My mom is like, your fans are waiting. Why are you not doing video for them? It's enough. Your break is enough. She would tell my sister, she report me to my family members. <laughs> yeah, this gets to do video. I'm like, oh, it's not like I have many subscribers, anyways. But that's the mistake. Whatever you're doing, even though you feel like it's not a lot of, it's still growing, it's not where you want it to be. Don't be ashamed to push yourself out. So that's what I'm doing this year. This year, I'm shamelessly pushing myself, shamelessly promoting my little brand. That's you guys. I'm shamelessly putting myself out there. I'm even rooting now for a podcast, like to be on the podcast of one of these celebrities in the UK right now. I got that gig. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's one of my first wins to come this year. And by God's grace, when I get the gig to be on that podcast on YouTube here, I will introduce it to you guys. Of course, I can't post those videos on my channel, but I'm going to promote myself via that podcast because I'm going to be like, hey. I also have a YouTube channel, Midege. but you know what I'm saying? It's what I love to do, and I feel like this year I have a lot to give and I need to push for it. So that's what I want you to also learn this year. And that's the attitude I want you to put into your activities, into your dreams and goals, aspiration this year. No matter what you're doing, put in your best, root for yourself. People will not support you until it's beneficial, even if they want to. It's just a just a few number of people, you know, when it's not helpful, when you're not big, sometimes, you know, even your friends, they will not, see, so I'm that person that when my friends support me, I'm like, okay, that, 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 that's brilliant, like, okay, thank you very much, because I don't expect them to, it's just what life is, like, you don't, I'm not an entitled person, if you promote me, if you're my friend, I'm like, so grateful to you, and I, I will do other the thing is I will do the same for you. Honestly, I will do the same. I always do for my friends. Especially if I'm you know send me something to post for you, I will definitely post for you. But not everyone can do that for you. So that's when people do that for me. I'm like, thank you. This year, don't have that entitlement spirit. Push yourself. When you push yourself, when you get there, watch people support you. I'm not even joking. Then another thing was that when I got back from America, I decided that. I would take a small break. The small break developed into a bigger break. I felt ill at the point. There's this flu going on in the UK right now. I was very sick. I could hardly talk. There was a time I stopped picking calls because I could not talk. I took a bit of break from work. I was very sick. I didn't even feel myself anymore. Like I didn't know what was going on, honestly. And before I knew it, weeks, days turn to weeks and to months and you know, to film content was really hard. And apart from that, there was a time I had a car accident lately. That particular car accident, my car is in good shape, of people that don't know, but I brushed into someone else's car and it was a roller coaster of emotions for me. I'm going to discuss that actually in another video, maybe in one of my vlogs. I don't want to get emotional. But anyways, I was one of the car accident that really took a uh, toll on my emotions and everything. Those were one of the... That day I had a car accident, my plan was to come home and film a YouTube video because I was not going to work for the next couple of days. And I felt like, okay, it was time to film a video and that was just early in the year you know so so many things have happened and so on and so forth but i'm glad that i'm here in front of you this year there is a lot more to do and trust me guys when i say that i miss talking to my camera honestly and this year i feel like everyone um should not joke with god some of the lessons i learned last year was that don't joke with god there was something i was actually hoping and looking 
unto God for last year that came to me you know it was such an ajifi I'm not doing this year without God at all because <laughs> God answered me for something speedily last year and I will discuss it with you guys not now honestly not now maybe later subsequently and I just want to encourage anyone out there if you're planning to do this year without God my dear I don't know how you're gonna survive it this year you need God we all need God like don't I'm a testimony of God's goodness <laughs> last year honestly last year when I look back at it like it was just it didn't some things happened that didn't go quite well with me or didn't sit well with me but overall last year was indeed a blessing i got one of the greatest gifts that i have always wanted last year and god has sent me speedily so this year maybe i did god one thousand times last year this year i'm doing god one million times and i want you to also do the same keep praying keep working for that thing that you want and watch god answer you speedily <laughs> i'm not a pastor mrs so but then it is what i'm testifying for and i want you to believe me honestly moving forward guys last year i was very frustrated regarding my youtube channel i felt like i was not growing i was supposed to eat 3,000 subscribers last year at least that was my goal at least 3,000 max 5,000 yeah th that was the goal i didn't even eat my 3,000 let alone eating 5,000 i was very dejected especially when you look around and you see that other people are growing but then you don't know the sacrifices these people are paying or putting into their craft i felt like oh, i have what it takes to and don't forget that i said i really boxed myself last year i felt like i didn't pull myself out enough which i would definitely do this year i felt like and i, I know even i still know and i still feel like i have what it takes to build my channel i have what it takes to have you know a big following views and get everything that i want and more on youtube but you know i felt like quitting i'm not gonna lie last year i felt like quitting and just deleting my youtube channel and just let it go but i'm that person that no matter what happens youtube i love youtube i love this thing i'm doing i love it and i normally say that i'm not happy when i say that even if it's one person that watches my video i'm okay with it but then you know what you love and that thing is growing it's a bonus for you what you love and it's not growing you know it gets you down sometimes it's just a passion that makes you and keeps you going and that's one of my uh, messages for new youtubers out there don't relent it's gonna be tough when some people look at my subscriber they're like ah you're almost three thousand that's not bad i'm like that's bad but then i just tell myself well you're not doing bad but you need to do more like when i went to america i did some vlogs I expected some of those vlogs to do really well shout out to my friend uh von vicky talks she was the one that was telling me okay maybe your title change your title like this shout out to friends that help you that look look out for you she really looked out for me and i'm so grateful to her this is good and so this year i just want to pay more attention to my seo for people that are not content creators you might not understand what this is the title of the video sometimes helps your video to do well and so many other things especially when i see people that are doing well on youtube i'm like ah, ah, these people don't have 10 heads now they tell you they, ah we cannot do this thing ah. <laughs> you know so last year i was very dejected i felt like quitting my youtube so many times i even got tired of sending broadcasts to people to come and watch my video yeah i still feel like that anyways but it's something i love to do that's why some people reached out to me because they know that i have deep love for this craft of mine for this youtube that i do sometimes oftentimes even now right now i'm preparing for work very soon but i felt like i still need to come and do this like it's something i love if not for i've been under the weather and so many things have been happening lately i would have even done this like this first time video this year uh this year i'm just pushing myself out there and i felt like last year one of the mistakes i made on my channel was that i did not um bring so many faces sometimes i watch other people's channel and i feel like bringing people more or like other people new faces you know interviewing people learning one thing or the other discussing chit chatting on the channel sometimes it helps to grow it helps the growth subscribers and all that so i think i did less of that last year i did more of that in 2022 and 2021 and it helped me to grow my channel quite a lot if you look at my views in 2021 2022 it was far better than 2023 so this year i felt like i would do all of this because the way youtube works sometimes you do all of these things and you still don't grow <laughs> 
<laughs> it's crazy right i know it's insane honestly but i just feel like i need to put in the work i need to try i always have to try and i can't do this without you guys that's why i plead all the time for you guys to subscribe to my channel tell a friend to tell a friend this year we are learning how to buy houses how to you know so many contents are coming how to buy your own house how to manage your house in the uk how to so many things honestly and i'm bringing new people into this channel you're going to be seeing new new faces by god's grace i have a lot for you this year that break i took was intentional at the point it wasn't <laughs> but then you get what i mean i just want to give you the best on this channel and you don't want to miss out and somebody reached out to me i would not forget to say this she was like me dj is it big? whatever is happening to you i wanted to come back on youtube i miss you i miss your smiles i miss your personality thank you so much i got a lot of that, those messages like people told me when they watch my videos they're just elated like the energy me they just energy honestly you guys are what keep me going and i can't do this without you subscribe to my channel always tell a friend to subscribe it will mean a lot to me honestly it will mean a lot to me and you know this year i <laughs> just more maybe more thoughts of quitting but i won't quit honestly i pray i won't yeah, don't let me say i won't quit i'm putting so much energy this year on this channel on this youtube street i'm not going for anybody i've set out my goals and my targets and i hope that i smash this you know in this incoming or this year we are in already 2024 and another thing is moving forward regarding my personal life i think i just need to discuss a bit of enough of youtube 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 let me discuss my personal life a bit with you guys you know what i'm saying so finally this year your girl is stepping into the year as you know <laughs> i know so many people someone actually texted me one time like that she was like hey, i watched that your relationship video you never tell us if you're in relationship or not and she put that to the end of the video but she didn't see anything honestly okay i'm ready to come out to you guys <laughs> i am in a relationship okay i am in a very sweet relationship and i know there's nothing to hide it's not like i'm hiding my relationship but naturally right from time i'm not that person that posts my relationship out there and the person i'm seeing is not that person that wants to be on social media much it doesn't it's not really really a social media person you get what i mean but in subsequent times you guys are gonna meet who i am seeing right now but my relationship is getting stronger day by day i know that's what you guys want to see and you want to know and uh, this year maritali family wise i hope it's the concrete for myself and for you whoever is searching i pray that you're gonna find your person but this year is the year you know we have to get the money we have to get the man we have to get everything it just has to come together honestly and i'm so happy that i'm sharing that with you guys right now you know so regarding finances this year we are being intentional honestly if you're that person that you just squandered all your money last year and i normally say it's good to save it's good to have saving it's very imperative that you have something for rainy days you don't want to use all your fingers to feed and this i'm saying i'm also referring to myself we just have to have a plan b no matter what you do nine to five you have a job you just have to have a side also by the side especially when you live overseas and that's why i'm tr i'm happy to tell you guys that i am launching my hair brand this hair on my hair is by myself it's my brand i'm gonna post or insert some other pictures and videos of the hair that i'll be selling this year I actually started selling last year but was offline so this this year i'm opening i've already opened the instagram account but i've not started posting and i want you guys to support me i have good hairs honestly look at it look at it i'm going to share videos and pictures and everything i'm going to also post on my instagram and i want you to follow my new account and purchase hair from me quality hair it's not hair that you pass and people will be like what is that on your on her head no it's something that when you wear outside your god people are gonna turn their head i'm like oh is this chick because it's quality or nothing personally i don't like to buy wish wash so i don't sell wish wash so i just encourage everyone out there buy it from me it's mainly braided hair and afro it's not woman hair um you know uh, wigs and all that it's just braided woman hair you get what i'm saying not the one you brush out braids i sell braids i sell 
nano braids different kind of braids french curls anything you want just go to my page or dm me on instagram delivery is free within uk even nigeria you have to just pay a token but within the uk delivery is free and i want you to purchase from me now see that side also that you have at the back of your mind that you've always wanted to start but you're shy i was just i see people say oh i'm shy i don't know how to sell markets you're not ready my dear you are not ready personally do you know i make care days that i'm not busy i tell my clients to come in i make care i can see i braid i do whatever anything for the money to be complete my dear you can't just sit on the couch and be complaining my salary is not enough this uk is very hard nothing works here my dear it will not work if you don't put in the work it will not work if you don't put in the work how bad you just have to stand up and think and you have that business that some of you are even so bad you are so good that you have that business outlined you have it you know drafted out it's not going to be easy you're going to be frustrated there are days you want to quit but if it's something you always wanted to do just go for it what else do i want to discuss in this video i don't want to make it too super long anyways for people that are so worried i'm in a better place right now i'm moving forward and growing so many things in the bag this year and i'm doing well just know that i'm doing well in all ramifications and my job you know it's gonna be a year very soon that i moved and relocated to a new part of the uk and trust me i love it here it's been a roller coaster of emotions there are times i'm like why did that even move from where i was what was the what was the motion what was the notion <laughs> but overall i'm so happy um i'm mentally spiritually financially every everything wise i am doing great and i can't wait to bring to you to your screen everything that i have planned by god's grace we're gonna have a wonderful youtube journey this year please in all ramifications enough of my blabbing tell somebody to subscribe to my channel it's going to mean a lot to me if you guys don't subscribe i will i will like survive on this youtube street there is no way so tell someone to subscribe and buy my hair my hair's band i'll put it on your screen as you can see braids by me the j uh, whatever i don't know i'll just put it on your screen anyways follow my account please on instagram buy it from me tell a friend to tell a friend i have good brains i've come to the end of this video i can't remember anything else i want to say right now <laughs> if i do remember i'll put in my subsequent videos okay but i welcome myself back to the youtube street i'm yet to also they see i'm not going for anybody not even you my dear i am not green i am coming with full force on the youtube street and i'm giving it all my best Follow me on Instagram if you haven't. I'm on Snapchat at MediaJ. I'm on TikTok at MediaJ with a love energy, as you can see on your screen right now. I love you all. Thank you so much for checking up for me. And now I think I can rest. <laughs> I'm putting out a video very soon on how to single and deadly buy a house or mortgage a house in the UK for single Pringles that don't have anybody, but they want to, they have God. Small girl, big God, or small man, big God. That wants to buy houses in the UK or mortgage houses and you don't know how to go about it. That will be one of my subsequent videos that I'm so in love with. And I'll be bringing somebody to the channel who just did that recently. And she'll be sharing all the tea with us on how she went about buying a house all by herself in the UK. If you see this lady's condo, mwah, beautiful. You don't want to miss it. Please, please, please kindly subscribe to my channel. Don't forget the bell like symbol on your screen youtube will notify you whenever i post a new video and i love you so so much it's still your girl n to the i to the d to the e to the i'll see you guys very soon Bye -bye.